Hi YouTube. As the title says, today's video is all going to be all about fall. Specifically, it's going to be about transitional dressing. I'm going to be sharing with you easy outfits that you can wear now and show you how I'll transition those same outfits for later. I don't know about you guys, but I'm tired of the heat and I'm seriously looking forward to fall. Okay? 2020 is not canceled. Let's have the best fall ever. If you're new here, hi, my name is Chi Chi, and on this channel, we cover fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So if that's the kind of stuff you're into, you're in the right place. Without further ado, let's get into this video. So guys, here I have like a super um, easy, like weekend outfit, perfect for running errands, etc., etc. I'm wearing this crew neck tee from the menswear section at Walmart. I have this in three other colors. I like a men's t-shirt just because they have a crew neck, number one, and they tend to have longer sleeves, which is like a tip for those of us, you know, who tend to be a little bit thicker around the arms. And then I tucked it into my favorite, favorite, hands down, favorite pair of straight cut. Love the curvy fit of these jeans. They fit snug to the waist. Um, no gap in the back. These came into my life. I was just like, where have you been? So I'm going to put a link to them because in my opinion, they are a must have, especially for my curvy girls. Um, for accessories, I just went with some hoops and um, my watch and I'm about to throw on my bag and a pair of slides. That's the look. This is perfect for running errands on the weekend. Maybe a very casual brunch with friends, casual date night, etc. Et this is what how I would wear this now. Now let's transition this look into fall. So for the fall version of this look, I decided to change out my um, slides for some mules, like so. That's the easy way to kind of transition into fall if you don't want to quite commit yet to a boot I don't know about you but I love having my feet out and a mule kind of gives you some coverage and some warmth I just threw on this trench coat as well and then I just, I just I kept my bag the same depending on how fall it is or how cold it is you could also throw on like you know a scarf to add an ad additional warmth if you would like but I would say that we have a pretty long fall here in the mid-atlantic so it's still like fall weather up until mid to late november um and it's just easy it's comfortable and yeah let me know your thoughts would you fit would you change anything how would you make this outfit you know more appropriate for fall for this next look, I wanted to put together like everybody's current summer uniform and show you like how you could transition it into fall. I'm wearing uh, just an oversized white t-shirt with some biker, biker shorts and yeah, I have it on like with a pair of Converse's and like a bum bag. That would be my ideal sort of like running out, um, running errands look, super easy. So now let me show you how I would transition it for fall. The fall transitional look, I decided to throw on this jacket. I this is just something about this jacket that I love, especially I think the belt really helps to put the look together and make it appropriate for a night. Same t-shirt, same biker shorts, everything's pretty much the same. I just threw this on top of it and I cinched this. This is old and I finished things off, of course, with a pair of red pumps, pouch bag. This is still available for a fraction, a fraction of the price of like what, you know, you would pay if you bought the real Bottegas, so. If you want it, there will be a link to it down below, and it comes with a bunch of colors. I also have a similar style in black as well. So let me know in the comments below how you like to wear your biker um, shorts. First of all, do you like biker shorts? <laughs> and then second of all, um, do you uh, are you okay with dressing it up for night, or do you just stick to like casual errands and lounging? This um, outfit is all about 
one of my favorite pieces to wear pretty much most of the year and that is a slip skirt I just paired this slip skirt with another crew neck t-shirt the top and the bottom are actually both from Walmart I believe the skirt is still available so I will link it for you down below actually I believe both of them are still available so really really affordable this outfit and then to kind of like the summer outfit I would pair it with a pair of like my wraparound sandals you guys know I talk about these how much I love these in my most worn summer accessories haul I'll put a link to that video or you can go ahead and check it out I'm pretty sure pieces are gonna be on major sale pretty soon um, and then to finish things off a straw bag transition this outfit for fall I just threw on my favorite um, like boyfriend style denim jacket I love how chunky and just like you know warm this jacket is it has some weight to it, it has total gives me total vintage vibes <laughs> for a pair of sneakers. I feel like this is a perfect um, look for those slightly crisper fall days. And then if you really wanted to transition this outfit for like winter, you could throw on a long line jacket, like a cap. But yeah, you could even, because of the nature of how chunky this um, jacket is, you could probably layer a vest or sweater underneath it as well for some extra warmth. Let me know your thoughts about this look as well. Um, would you wear this? Is this like a fall look for you? Um, have I finally sold you on slip skirts, etc., etc.? Let me know in the comments below. So for this outfit, I just wanted to show another quintessential weekend look I don't know about you guys but with most of us working from home and quarantining I feel like my wardrobe has gotten a lot more like casual so I love a monochrome combo there's just something very chic about the coordinating look also it makes it super easy to get dressed so like green top green pants let me go so I paired it with a pair of leopard slides like so just keeping things neutral and easy and, and a net bag so this is like the perfect outfit if you have like if you're going to the farmer's market or something like that um this is the perfect look to wear but i'm going for a trouser here so that makes it a little bit more polished in my opinion just in case if you're wearing this during the week maybe you have to pop into the office show you how i transition this look for fall so to get this look ready for fall i just threw on a chunky sweater i absolutely love this one because it has like ginormous sleeves what i love is that voluminous sleeves are still back for fall so i'm gonna get my wear out of this one and then for shoes i decided to dress this look up and throw it on with a pair of pumps because hopefully now that outside is starting to open up we have more events and things to go to and then i finish things off with my trusty pouch bag i plan to get my wear out of this bag okay so and the pumps let me know in the comments below if you would style this differently um for fall um or if you like it do you like this outfit would you rock it let me know in the comments below bonus 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 <laughs> okay the bonus look is gonna feature this animal print or leopard print dress that I actually picked up from the Nordstrom sale. I had to at least include something for you guys from the sale. Don't worry, I am working on that try on as soon as I get my, my entire order. Um, hopefully before the sale ends, you guys will see that video. So yeah, it features this um, super loose and easy airy dress because you can layer above it underneath it pair with boots all that good stuff and for summer i just have it of course paired with my um 
net bag and then my favorite wraparound sandals and um yeah super easy casual perfect for running errands on the weekend I just like the way it kind of breaks up all the black adds a little bit of pop of color you can do color in the fall and I definitely mustard is one of those colors that transitions well from summer into fall let me know in the comments below do you prefer the summer look or do you prefer the fall look hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you got outfit ideas, tips, inspo, and want more, all you have to do is subscribe now. Yup. That, sit that red button right there. Just right there. And when you subscribe, make sure you turn on those notifications so you don't miss a video. When I'm not here on YouTube, which is most days i am on instagram especially now that we have instagram reels god help us um i share daily outfits styling tips and basically you get to interact with me in real time got a burning question or you're looking for a link to something i shared that is literally the best place to find me Links to all of my socials will be in the description box down below. Facebook, TikTok, my blog, all that good stuff is down there for you below. Links to everything I mentioned in this video also down there. Info about my hair, this dress, all of that is down there. If you enjoyed this video and want more summer outfit ideas, check out this video and catch up on my latest haul right here you get to rate comment subscribe and share and until next time stay blessed